Hey, what is going on the YouTube? This is Robert and today I'm bringing to a live cop for this week which is going to be week 13 of the fall winter season. Now this week is obviously going to be the North Face collaboration but we do also have a lot of decent lookbook items dropping including the balaclava and the lamp and a couple of other bits and pieces here and there. But for me I'm just going to be going for the North Face beanie because I saw the retail being as low as it was and I thought yeah, I can't read past on that. So yeah, we're just going to get straight into this. But as per norm, let me know down below whether you took a W or whether you took an L this week, what you took that WL going for. And yeah, good luck to those who are going for the drop tomorrow on Saturday in Japan. Other than that, I hope that everyone got what they're after in store or got what they wanted from either Supreme or Palace. And yeah, let's just see how this goes. It should be smooth and easy, but yeah, let's just see. <laughs> okay, so obviously I'm just going to sit under the new tab and yeah, there isn't really much to say. I was also shocked to see how much this jacket is now going for, or sweater more so is now going for, because it's nearly like a thousand pounds, which must just mean it had like no stock whatsoever. But yeah, uh, okay, the drop is in. There's the beanie, and we can open up balaclavas and the G-Shock, but let's just grab this, 36 pounds. Yeah, I'm not passing on that. Do they still have capture? They don't, it would seem. Nice one. So that's just going to process across, hopefully, plain and simple. I don't really expect the beanie to sell out, being honest. Uh, I don't really see it doing that or see it just flying in the end. I am just going to have to wait to see if I actually check out or get my order, like confirmation, just that I've got that, like, set. Supreme. Okay, fine. 50 pounds on the balaclavas. None are sold out. G-Shock 168. None are sold out. I'd really like this to check out. Is that so, like, so much to ask for? I will be honest that I did have some difficulties the other day when I went to check something out on Supreme. I was just doing it as a general test. Um, because recently I've had some issues with my card anyway, or with cards and checking out on things anyway. This morning on Palace seemed to be quite easy, but it seems that places that heavily use or heavily rely on like 3D Secure or 3DS, uh, I've been having some like technical problems with. Is it me or the Supreme site? Just like really, really bright for some reason. Like the colors are out there. Um, let's just refresh this. See, I don't personally think that these would fly fly. I feel like this might, but it's dependent on a lot. Let's go ahead and take a look to see if anything is actually sold out. If nothing is sold out, I'm gonna be like, wow, because I am just gonna be like, wow, aren't I? Really on a week like this? Or can people just not check out? So I'm seeing people check out uh, Palace, obviously because Palace and Supreme are at the same time. Yeah, they're, <laughs> they're like none for Supreme. A lot of people are saying to use Apple Pay or should be using Apple Pay. I'm very surprised to be honest to see that not even this jacket is like gone. That's like, yikes. Maybe Palace overshadowed Supreme today with its drop because a lot of people are more interested in it as far as I can tell compared to Supreme. Can this check out though? You know when we went through this phase a little bit ago where it was like, I'm not gonna check out. It's like, I'm not gonna let you check out. I'm not gonna let it happen. And I'm here just like, great. It's not letting me check out, it's not letting me process. It seems that we're back there. So some people's orders are currently going through now. Uh, I've got incognito and my normal uh, like page open uh, and I can't check out. So I'm pausing because I've just seen a, a picture of someone's food from Thanksgiving and I've got no idea <laughs> what is on the plate. We're just gonna go through the tabs and sections and yeah. Obviously under jackets, we've got the tape seam, we've got the half zip, and we've got the world famous Jack Yard as well. Uh, I'm surprised that these haven't sold out. Oh, like genuinely, I'm actually surprised they haven't sold out. In America, people have said that size large and some of them, like the colorways have sold out, but in Europe, it's a uh, yikes. We obviously have the shearling line piece, which is still in stock, so we can just go straight. I knew that was a fly. <laughs> got it. <laughs> Um. <laughs> so under top slash sweaters, we've got the zip up alongside the long sleeve and the hockey piece. Uh, all of them are still in stock. So the piece, this piece, uh, is very similar to the Palace and the Kith piece. However, obviously this retail is half of the Kith retail and probably like 40 or 50 pounds above the Palace one. I don't know, to be honest. I feel that it's not going to be that wearable and if you were you'd have to have something underneath whether that be a long sleeve or another thing of like significant size so 
I don't know. As far as sweatshirts are uh, concerned, we've just got the pigment uh, hoodie alongside the patchwork piece. Yeah, all still in stock. It's not just me. I swear this is like extremely bright for no reason. Like, it's really weird. <laughs> Underpants, we've got the pigment pan as well as the world famous pan. And yeah, they're still all in stock. We can move on to the hats tab now where I still can't check out. I'm still processing. So I'm guessing I should have just done PayPal. Realistically, if I want it, I can still pick it up with PayPal. But yeah, I'd just rather it just go through because I don't want to have a double order occur again because it's really quite annoying. Uh, the packable ear flap is still in stock as well. And yeah, uh, the new era is in stock too. As far as the balaclava is concerned, it's still in stock, which is a surprising thing because in America, quite a few colorways have sold out. Uh, and the fleece lined is still in stock, so yeah. Under accessories uh, is where the sleeping bag and the G-Shock are going to be sitting and they are definitely sitting. Wow, yeah. So this was 248, yeah. Mm. It's so cool, but at the same time, Oh, it's two person. Now I'd do that as one and just roll over and like <laughs> wrap yourself up. Let's just go on to the sizing tab where I go through this three by three and if you'd like to, you can pause at any point in time. I'm just, I wouldn't even say pleasantly surprised. I'm just surprised in general that uh, nothing's really sold out or if they have, it's just like a minimal amount of sizes. I was expecting a lot of stuff to actually go, but it seems that because of uh, Thanksgiving, delaying Supreme by that day with Palace occurring. Sometimes in the past it's been Palace being like not so strong. So as of that, people heavily focus on Supreme. This time it seems it's vice versa and people are more so focusing on Palace over Supreme. And if they're going for Supreme, they're just picking up a balaclava and basically just calling it a day there. So yeah, I'm just, I don't know, confused as to why I couldn't check out. But at the same time, it might just be a blessing because in about 45 minutes time, hopefully I have this uploaded by then, uh, I will be going for De Schürze, uh, who are dropping some really clean things today, but I'm going to be buying a balaclava and a scarf and a beanie from them, um, because, yeah, I like them, so, yeah, and I think the balaclava is really cool, like a really clean design, um, but yeah, that is going to cover sizing, so let's just head back to the new tab, has this processed anywhere? Nope. Hasn't processed anywhere, so that's good. Uh, but let's just go through the new tab one last time and then we can close off the video. So the 800, is it Phil? Yeah, the 800 Phil in grey has sold out, which I did not expect that to be the first one. It was the better colorway, but I did not expect that because the other things are sitting. So that's surprising, okay. Uh, other than that, we can go down and look. And to be honest, I don't really think that anything else is going to have sold out it hasn't oh yeah i missed one of the hats as well but it's not sold out so yeah but yeah just going on to it briefly because i did just want to show it this is the uh, balaclava from the schutzer which i think is really cool it also gives me like uh monkey do luffy uh with what we're going to see for him just the smile and everything and the stuff to the side you could also say like demon slayer or something else but yeah i really like it i really think it's a really cool balaclava uh and then just the scarf combo they're dropping i think is really cool as well you've got a cool little beanie with a frog on it and then you've got the casino frog set i think it's just a really cool overall thing i would go for a wallet but i've already got one from them the last one i got i just held on to then sold i don't really feel like doing that this time um but yeah anyway that is going to cover this video i don't really think you could have enjoyed uh but if you picked anything up let me know down below what that was or whether or not you took a W or an L going for whatever you went for and yeah that is going to cover it from me so I should hopefully have a review for the Jordans out tomorrow but I'm going to do my best with that I have to see but yeah uh, that is going to cover it anyway so I hope that you have a good rest of your day and I will see you all next time. Peace.